What is happening everyone, it is your boy Brad here and welcome along to the video and this is the preview and predicted lineup. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that for the game tomorrow between Arsenal and Newcastle United dead game for me, dead game the main game is um, Thursday which is against Villarreal obviously we know from the first leg we're 2-1 down lucky to get out of jail with the um, the away goal but I'm just hoping for a fight back I'm just hoping that we get a response from Arsenal especially from the players that didn't turn up in that game against Villarreal but I'm hoping for a, a change of the lineup because it is needed but personally um, it needs to be done because Thursday was an absolute shambles and we need to keep winning to try and push up at least as far as we can get in the league so we're not getting above top 8 no way we're getting above top 8 so um, yeah so it's about it in terms of the well say that's about it but I just can't be asked speaking about Arsenal right now see it's doing my head in life as an Arsenal fan is not as easy as you think it's not easy at all considering the downfalls to it but let's hope for a response tomorrow against Newcastle but our home record speaks for itself that it is not great it is absolutely abysmal <coughs> sorry about that um, but let's just hope we do get a response because I hope that we can take some momentum going into the Villarreal game with a decent performance and a decent win against Newcastle but let's get into the uh, predicted lineup a starting goal I'm going to go with Matt Ryan I'm going to take Leno out of the firing line for this because it's a dead game and I think Matt Ryan deserves minutes didn't put a foot wrong against Fulham so I would start him uh, going to the defence starting off right back I'm going to go with Cedric Suarez Chambers was not good enough on Thursday so I'll bring him out and bring Cedric in see how he does I won't play Bellerin but knowing Mikel and his way of it he will probably play Bellerin because showing favouritism towards certain players um, <coughs> sorry about that going to the centre back partnership I'm going to start off with um, David Luiz, I'm going to bring him back in give him some minutes he is fit, he is ready and I will give him some minutes ahead of the Villarreal game uh, alongside him I'm going to put Gabriel in again another defender that deserves minutes and deserves a chance uh, I'm going to the left back position ah this is where we get this is where it gets tough because Granit Xhaka I do not want to see him but the experiment is done I don't want to see him there anymore so I would personally put Saka there, Bukai Saka he has played there before so I don't know why we can't play him there again but I will personally go with that uh, going into the midfield starting off with Granit Xhaka back in the midfield where he belongs alongside him Thomas Partey needs to improve his game because he has been utter shocking recently passing has been off and such but he does show moments of why we bought him and that's why we'll go with going into the right wing position uh, Nicola Pepe he's been our shining light for quite a few games now but he needs to uh, start getting some goals going to the centre attacking mid position Martin Odegaard I'm going to go with I'm going to bring Smith Rowe out the firing line for this one and leave him out of the team till probably Thursday uh, going into the left wing position I'm going to play Gabriel Martinelli um, deserves minutes I don't know why, what Mikel's got against him or anything like that but uh, we shall wait and see and then going to the striking position I'm going to play Florian Balogun now the reason being is simple because he deserves a chance why don't you give him a chance he signed a new deal why not give him a new deal why not give him a, why not give him a chance 
why not give them a chance? And that is it for the video for the preview and predicted lineup against Newcastle. So stick around if you're new, subscribe to the channel, and if you're obviously a subscriber, like, share the channel so I can get more subscribers. And we will see you next time, which will be Monday, for the reaction and player ratings video for the game tomorrow. So guys, till next time, we'll see you later.